we are here in Garal again in central Somalia and uh, this is not a river this is not a lake this is a shallow uh, reservoir uh, dug by the local government to keep the rainwater here it lasts about two to three months in this area and it's far more cheaper than having the it's a very, most traditional way of keeping the water for the animals or maybe for the people for up to two to three months maximum as we have seen before the uh, water reservoir built by muslim aid which will actually last each one of them another two to three months they finish this one first then they go to open the other uh, water reservoir in different uh, areas which muslim aid have been dug, uh, about 20 of them when you look at it this is very climate friendly i can feel the nice wind blowing on me and this is locally built by the local farmers sometimes in different areas this is no they would not there's no coating for the shallow uh, reservoir here but in certain area there could, could be sometimes they put some coating of plastic sheeting to keep to keep the water uh, more time uh, not to have to be uh, 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 going deep into uh, the land and this is another another way of dealing with the rain water with the rain water this kind of shallow reservoir or the deep reservoir uh, built by muslim aid in this area to keep the water between all of them for about three to four to five to six months in this area and this is very beneficial why because it keeps the water become handy it's not expensive it's not sophisticated and front uh, uh, climate friendly but our solution here is not only to build this kind of shallow uh, reservoir or the deep reservoir on the river uh, flow uh, area when the rain comes down. Our solution for the droughts oh, which are affecting Somalia every other year is rehabilitating dams and building dams. Rehabilitating dams and building dams. Let us say all of them. Number one priority, rehabilitating and building dams. Number two, if you want to dig wells, nobody will stop you, but the wells will take the reserve, the reserve of water from the land and will dry later on. Number three, which will be far more cheaper, the shallow reservoir here or the deep reservoir, which is built by Muslim aid in the other areas. I thank you, everyone seeing me today. Also, I thank Muslim aid that have been doing all this great and magnificent work in Somalia and I hope that other organizations will sit down together to think seriously about how we build real dams. The dam should be built by a handful or a dozen of organizations because it costs millions of dollars. But it stays for a long period of time and change the climate totally and build the community around it. Thank you everyone. Thank you everyone. We're going to see another water reservoir after we finish this one.